Hi, glad to see you back for our seventh video. Today, we're going to explore how to build points, curves, surfaces, and breps step by step. Let's get started. Vector Construct point We created a point at the origin. Let's learn how to create sequential points by generating a number sequence. Sets Range We generated 11 numbers from 0 to 1. Connect to the X coordinate. Let's continue by adjusting the number of points and their intervals. Steps 10 Double click on the Grasshopper canvas to open the search bar. 0 less than 300 0 to 300 Connect to the steps. Fifteen. Domain, zero to one. We can directly connect a slider to this input to set the maximum value. Fifteen point zero. Connect to the domain. Domain, zero to fifteen. Thirty five point five. Click the mouse wheel. Zoom. Double click the slider. 35. Let's create another point series using the same number sequence. Control plus C, Control plus V. By adjusting the Z coordinate, let's create a point series at a different height. 5.0. Connect to the Z coordinate. 10. While holding down the Alt key and the right mouse button, drag to the left to split the canvas. Let's learn the relay tool for organizing connections. Double click on a wire to create a relay. Now, the connections will look more organized. Connect the relay to the X coordinate. Steps 68 Let's use another range to create a sine wave. Range It is important that the steps we create here are equal. Connect the slider to the steps. We will use pi as the input for the sine calculation. Maths Util Pi Connect to the domain. Domain, 0 to pi. Let's use a panel to view the number list we created. Params. Panel. Connect the range to the panel. Steps. Domain, 0 to pi. Steps. 37. Maths. Sign. Connect the range to the sign. Connect the result to the panel. Connect the result to the Y coordinate. We shifted the points along the Y axis using a sine wave with a value of pi. Let's increase the coefficient of pi in the sine function to add more sine waves. 0 less than 20.0. 0, 0 to 20.0. Connect to the factor. Twelve point three. Delete Steps one hundred thirty six. I factor eight point zero. 
Let's amplify the wave intensity by increasing the sine factor. Multiplication Connect the result to the A input. Connect the result to the Y coordinate. Zero less than 4.00. Connect to the B. One point fifty. Now, let's learn how to create curves using these points. Curve Interpolate Connect the point to the vertices. Control plus Q. Control plus C, Control plus V. Connect the point to the vertices. Steps, 254. Control plus Q. Let's create a surface between the curves we generated. Surface. Freeform. Ruled surface. Connect the curve to the curve A. Connect the curve to the curve B. Wow! Looks good. Control plus Q. Freeform. Extrude. Connect the surface to the base. We will use unit y as the direction. Vector. Vector. Unit y. Connect to the direction. We should hide the previous surface we created. Control plus Q. Control plus C. Control plus V. Connect to the factor. 0 0.35 Sine wave amplification Domain 35.0 Pi factor 1 3 1 2 3 8 Finally, let's bake our grasshopper project into Rhino. Right-click on the extrusion output. Bake. Click OK. Perspective. Shaded. Move. High factor. 5.0. Sine wave amplification. 2.35. Right click on the extrusion output. Bake. Click OK. Move. Perspective. Rendered. Options. Mesh. More polygons. Click OK. Thanks for watching, see you in the next tutorial.